What's going on you guys? Sasuke Wolf here bringing you a how-to video for my wonderful family STD-X set to destroy X. Um, if you're watching this, this means that you want to know how to set up the chatty Twitter client thing, whatever we're going to be, we're going to be using to actually pop tabs easily and you don't have to worry about popping actual tabs of Twitch and it won't be taking as much uh, uh, memory but you won't be using your CPU usage. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna run through a quick little tutorial about how to set this up, where to get it and all that. I'll even um, include the links to where the program is as well as everything else. Um, you should be able to know the location though. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead and transition over here to the monitor. Um, what I'm gonna show you here, okay, so what uh, I have already ready is the chatty website the website I'll put down in the description there's the link as well as um, I won't put down these critical areas because of the fact that you should already know by now where they're at if you don't know where they're at um, please hit up anyone in the org chat um, to actually get those that information so what I have here is the chatty we got the STS X streamers list itself and I'll be showing you uh, what to do with this so what we're gonna do is for the chatty website we're gonna go ahead just type in the, the link or click the link below head over to the download versions depending on your computer first download Java don't matter how it is just click on it it'll take you to Java right off the back download the free Java do the setup it's pretty simple and easy I'm not gonna run it through it, it should only take you about like two or three minutes uh, after that figure out what your system is if you don't know your system then there's something wrong because if you're a streamer you should already know what system you're running just in case if you don't know what your system is you're gonna right click down on the on the Windows tab if you're a Windows if you're uh, if you're uh, on a different Mac PC uh, Mac now nah, I have no idea I don't deal with it all you have to do is just go to system and then it'll bring up the information it'll tell you pretty much what your uh, what it is right here under system type once you have the system type either the 32 or 64 you'll know exactly which one you do click on the 64 since I have 64 um, it'll go ahead and really quick download it all you're gonna do really quick is bring it up and this you should be doing it right off the back it shouldn't take that long I normally like to extract it uh, but in this case what we're gonna do is I'm gonna just grab this jar file and then just put it up on the desktop that's it that's what I've been doing that's all I've been uh, having to uh, do now here's the easiest thing ever just click on it uh, normally when you click on it it'll come up and ask you um, what file what do you want to open it with things like that if it ever does come up with a file of how what to open it with all you have to do is right click it open with Java that's it it it'll ask you either way once uh, asked once you do that you're gonna go ahead and do the login information whoops sorry about that uh, I kind of clicked out of it um, we're gonna go ahead and request the login data once you request data it'll ask you um, you know all this all you're gonna do is open browser it'll ask you to authorize it go ahead and authorize it once it says token has been received minimize it and you'll see it already checked out now verify the login and it'll say verify ready to connect done your name is there already and what you do is you just press connect so now here's the thing though my since it, mine's already been set up and activated before already you're seeing every tab being open and popped of those that I've already set up for so once I open it up and I click it it's already set up so now what you're gonna do here is you could do multiple ways you could go to a join channel which this is where your actual streamers list comes in place just take the ending portion of the URL which is their name 
of their Twitch and just type it in to join the channel. That's all it is. So with each and every one that I've already have you guys tabbed open, that's all I did. You just join the channel. I'll join my own once this is done because everyone's already should be already popped up here and it'll tell you down on the corner when they are live as well so for example we're gonna go ahead and type in my name well my channel name which is Sasuke Wolf and then we're gonna join the channel there it is you see we just joined it I am offline and it will tell you what they are hosting as well so once you're joined in, as simple as that, you just saw me join in, you could go to your favorites list, scroll on down, you see, I'm already there at the bottom of the list. That's pretty simple. This is everyone, every 40 plus members that is streaming. Um, you could type it in, each one, and then it'll add to the list. All you have to do is just add to favorites, and it's now added onto the list. Where am I going? There I am, you see? I have it set up where it's in order. So it's alphabetical order. You can even remove selected ones from the list. It should take you no more than five minutes to actually type in each and every one to add to the list. That's all you gotta do. Once it's done, you could actually, let's go ahead and close out each one. Close all, close all. So you see, we're gonna, we're gonna close it all out i'm sorry you guys i do have my son over here and i do apologize you guys once again i had to cut the video um because my son was making big ruckus as soon as he realized that he was running around so really quick once you have your favorites list and all that you can go ahead and head to your favorites click on the top one control a you know select them all choose channels you're all set and done simple as that pop your tabs you guys shouldn't be that that hard that it's that simple um, if you guys want to know who's live there is a little commands list here control L you know bring up your your uh, your live and everyone is live including how many hours how many minutes how many viewers so like for example rake here has four viewers and been live for two minutes and then we got dark here with eight viewers live for 32 minutes so so forth and so on everyone else that I've been following and uh, and all that so everyone's got their tabs open everyone's got their their things here's preschool you see there's there's Josh that I also follow got everyone so like let's go to dark it'll take time for everything to actually stop there we go so there's dark and you have everyone's list everyone's name so you're all set so I hope you guys I hope this actually helps you guys pretty much if you guys need help don't for, don't be afraid to let us know have team viewer have Skype we'll go ahead and set you up no more than five minutes all right you guys so I'm gonna go ahead and head off here and this is maybe about like a 10 minute video for you guys so I do apologize but I will see you guys again with another how to just let me know if i if you like this video please don't be afraid and then see what happens uh after that so i'll see you guys next time